All right, so I got this peekaboo right here, and it's got my audio for one of the rooms in there. I got the power supply. I plug the cable into the audio out. So we'll plug that into the computer. I've got uh, Audacity opened. And let's see if I get any audio out of this thing. Let's see. It's going to be. So we can hear it, or we can see it. And now I need to go to the speakers. I don't know why it's not outputting to my speakers, but I can see it recording. Hmm. All right, well, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to stop this by removing the power supply. And I'm going to record. And I'm going to plug it back in. And just let it record. All right, so I've got the file. And now I am in Premiere because it's easiest for me to use. And I am editing it. Gonna chop off everything that I don't need. And chop it. Delete it. Now I have the file that I need right there. I'm going to put some transitions on it. Let's see the effects. Let's go to audio transitions, crossfade. Constant power there. And then let's put a small fade on it over here. I don't want it to be too much, so I'm just gonna shorten this down to like nothing, hardly. I'll do the same thing over here. Shorten that down to like nothing. And then here we go. Save. And then come down to the end. Make sure the end sounds alright. Right, save. Now we're gonna export it. So once I export it, I will see y'all on the other side where I'm going to program it into the peekaboo. Look over there, way over there. That's where our makeup room is. I'm actually out on the second balcony right now. So, fun times, fun times. Work in progress, work soon. So I'm gonna get back to work. All right, so the current situation is I'm trying to get electrical cord from the other side of this wall through this little hole right here. So. There's somebody clear across the other side. It's like two rooms away, something like that. So I'm trying to get it done. I'll update you soon. All right, so the next step, we need a bigger hole there. So I'll have to get more tools, let's go. All right, so now I'm gonna search for a water hose. So, uh, yeah, doesn't know, don't know where we stand on other projects, but I'll get back with you uh, soon and uh, stuff. Where's our cargo? So here's a fun one for you all. You ever seen anybody sew with vice grips? <laughs> Trying to get these needles through this leather is kind of a task, so I'm having to force them through with the vice grips. Let's 
sometimes pull it out the other side too with the vice grips. best in the world but you know what it will do so how does this work it goes in the did I put this thing on backwards did I might have well, at this point in time, I really don't mind either way, as long as it works. I think I absolutely did put that on backwards. Maybe not. Maybe not. That goes through there. And that goes through there. And on the front. Yeah, I did that right. I did that right. That's the hot phone going off. So we have my repaired side here. And my... No, this is my repaired side from here. That's actually looking better than I thought it did. Okay. Alright. Repaired side here. And I got one more. No, that's not pinned up at all. Sweet. Uh, this is the one that I need to do. There's one more on the back side. Okay, dokie, so one more repair job here. More sewing with vice grips. And here we go. Alright, so it ain't the prettiest sewing job in the world, but it will get the job done. So everything's happy again. Yay! Thank you, Julie. Road rash? Yeah. <laughs> 